So we already know what this C is. This is the, uh, that, <laughs> the beginning. Okay. We are talking about that. We are talking about that mostly, first and foremost. Um, this is Cliffhanger. And it is a very cinematic game. <laughs> As you will now see. Go ahead and roll with the intro. You know, let it do it. A um, couple things I want to say. Basically, I think I borrowed this from Scott as well. <laughs> he had all the money. So, the one thing I do take into account about this is like I was in my little bedroom with my little CRT and I had my Sega CD, which was totally implementing all of the FMV full motion video in terrible quality, by the way, but it was like. If you had to be there <laughs> I guess you had to be there in my room because we were broke and dad was in the TV room we had all that but I had this and uh, look at that yeah, yeah it was like a Hollywood cinema in my room and you know I'm all about that with the Sega CD but um Uh, please don't tell me my mic audio is jumping because of... Ah, let's well, just find out. Let's just find out. So basically what they did was cut all the scenes of the movie down to lackluster quality so they could fit kind of a story into it to tie the gameplay together. So, so basically, I wanted to draw you in with like basically like giving you the movie or whatever. Where's the helicopter? It can't fly in this weather. Let's go watch the movie. <laughs> so what you're doing is basically playing a straight up beat em up. Point scoring system. That's easy. I think, yeah. It reminds me a little bit of Streets of Rage. Like, not as good by any means. Not as good. Um, if you get the system down. But of course, I'm all struck at the soundtrack of this. Which Full motion, full orchestra, orchestrated. Not very common in, in that, that time of day. Um, this is a 16 bit game, essentially. I mean, it's, it's a little shiny. Well, not shinier. Not even polished. Smoother. Let's put that, let's put that way. So. Yeah, I, I think if you paid attention to the uh, fighting style, like it was... Oh. <laughs> I was going to say it was easy to grab onto until I got my ass handed to me. And, uh, yeah. It was limited, but I mean, a lot of games were. You know? I mean, as far as what you do, and every time you do that, you lose energy. I know that. I mean, projectile weapons, you know, all you gotta do is step to the right. Well, I have a knife, I think. Okay. That's the job. All you can... All you can eat. <laughs> Early 90s. Hey. Have fun, have fun. And I keep sweeping, which is taking away my energy. And I know you can throw this, I just keep forgetting how. Ah! Get my ass handed to me. <laughs> it's 
start from the beginning. <laughs> I don't think so. We're climbing. We're climbing. So you have to dodge gunfire. No, it's not Contra going up the hill. You have absolutely no. So yeah, you just remember the patterns and wait. Like that's basically what you're doing. I don't feel like waiting, so I'm gonna get shot off the rocks. <laughs> Leon Jenkins. Oh wait, that's a jumping maneuver. I made it up. Who knew? That's a save point every time we get to the fire. <clears throat> I didn't know I was jumping into this all of a sudden. But yeah, this is the infamous snowboarding level. Um, that's what the game was uh, made famous for. Avalanche! Because uh, um, this was like so ahead of its time. It really was. Um, it was a fun challenge to avoid, obviously, the rocks as well as the avalanche coming behind you as soon as you get, as soon as you get too many obstacles. Um, I will admit, it felt a lot better on the second controller, the bigger buttons. I'm using a not that. <laughs> I'm using a not a second controller. See, so you can cheat by jumping. Then you have to go under, and I am wiped out again. I mean, again, I think my well, this being amazing for its time, but that was my big draw to this game was the orchestrated soundtrack. I mean, it really. <laughs> When you heard that score, it got you moving. <laughs> and I mean, I had to beat this before. Like I said these buttons are not as responsive. Ah. Yeah, I was gonna get ran over again. Oh, I wanted to at least hit that tunnel. That was cool. Oh, yeah, you hit the top. Let's build back up your, your lead. Uh, 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 I don't know. As you can see, I mean, it's a challenge, but it can be fun. Ah! He does, uh, he does a mute grab, but he gets no score. <laughs> No, 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 no. It's getting farther than me. I have. Yeah, sometimes jumping. Oh, oh, wiped out. Okay, there's that. That happened. <laughs> That's cool, though. What's next? Let's we'll say I made it. That's what happens. Frank, find me to the West Valley. The winds are never too strong there. It's only a half hour climb to the Douglas Shaft. It's the only shelter for miles around. Hal would have to go there. Hold up! Where is it? Really, just um, tie you into the story. Gives you uh... a. I really did try to do that. <laughs> I was like, oh, we're gonna turn this movie into a game. And it kind of did. I don't know. I didn't buy it. I borrowed it. <laughs> but it's always held a special place. It really did. Like, nostalgia. Oh my gosh. I wanna shoot the gun. <laughs> well, you better get better than better than this. There's the gun. Rat tat tat tat. Rat tat tat tat. Oh, you throw stuff too. I don't see. 
yeah, the actual combat system, <laughs> like I mentioned before, is it's not difficult. I mean, all you have to do is just kind of skip while they move with you. So there's that. There's that. Like I kind of want to just die. <laughs> oh yeah, remember? You have to run. Run, 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 run. Ah! <laughs> Let's continue. Run, run. And then run into gunfire. No, I got paranoid. <laughs> Fuck you, die. Fuck you, die. Fuck you, die. Fuck you. 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 <laughs> oh, I'm out of bullets. Hell, Mary, mother of bullets. Oh, you roundhouse me. I roundhouse did to me out of the air. Let's see how it is. Oh, so I don't need to run. I just jump on a log. Jump on a log. Avoid the knives. Jump over the thing. So I had to have a run. Ah! That sucks. <coughs> Dang! Knife throwing! All the knives. What the? No fireplace for slaves either. Uh, you wait for him to pause. See, there's a. There's a system that I don't feel like following. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> you are rewarded with a cutscene. Every time you beat that shit, which was not too bad. Now, I think they stole this. Or did, did Die Hard do this first? I don't know. Yeah, I think. It's always from that. You okay, motherfucker? I'll be so happy if this works. <laughs> and I've said that a lot of times in my videos. To dislike this Mr. Walker. He can't be far. Find him. Go. John, let's go. Uh, who else is in this? Uh, <laughs> Michael Rooker. <laughs> Michael Rooker, yeah, of course. Sly. See, I mean, you get the idea pretty quick. <laughs> Forgot how to throw the knife. Like I was, oh man, give, give me a nice reach. All right, doing better than I thought I would. <laughs> would. Although I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Just like that. <laughs> Hilarious. Eh. One thing that I want to note is that, yeah, because I'm not doing that climbing shit again. <laughs> I went in there and grabbed it on the last time when I tried to do this. Can't say this for a lot of games that I stream, but I stream and I record. But I actually own this one. <laughs> Found it at the Goodwill. Is complete in box, as they like to say. <laughs> and the disc is minty, minty fresh. I'm not sure of the value. Doesn't matter. 
never found a Sega CD game in the wild. So yeah, that's Cliffhanger. <laughs>